Part 1 Leonardo da Vinci He has been variously called the father of paleontology, technology, and architecture, and is widely considered one of the greatest painters of all time. Sometimes credited with the inventions of the parachute, helicopter and tank, he epitomized the Renaissance humanist ideal many historians and scholars regard Leonardo as the prime exemplar of the universal genius, or Renaissance man, an individual of unquenchable curiosity and feverishly inventive imagination, and he is widely considered one of the most diversely talented individuals ever to have lived. According to art historian Helen Gardner, the scope and depth of his interests were without precedent in recorded history, and his mind and personality seemed to us superhuman, while the man himself mysterious and remote. Marco Rossi notes that while there is much speculation regarding his life and personality, his view of the world was logical rather than mysterious, and that the empirical methods he employed were unorthodox for his time. Born out of wedlock to a notary, Piero da Vinci, and a peasant woman, Caterina, in Vincenza, region of Florence, Leonardo was educated in the studio of the renowned Florentine painter, Andrea del Verrocchio. Much of his earlier working life was spent in the service of Ludovico il Moro in Milan. He later worked in Rome. Bologna in Venice, and he spent his last years in France at the home awarded to him by Francis I of France.